Hi guys, thanks for watching. Elise makes a bunch of videos. Welcome to vlog number 609. It's pretty crazy. Six, over 600 videos. Um, pretty sure that's an accurate number. It seems like a fun number to have. Um, today's vlog is a sort of random one, but it's one that I've thought about and talked about a lot. Uh, usually people are like, mm-hmm. Um, so you're welcome. This one is about how people are like ants, like similar to, not just the nonsensical like, but people are very akin to how ants are in groups. Um, I feel like a lot of information about how ants actually work is unknown, but um, they're very organized and they work together. And I think that there's a lot of little branches, but I'm just gonna go off on a couple of the main ones. Um, branches of explanation and similarity and why people are like ants. But basically one big one is like conspiracy theories. I hear a lot of people and they have their little conspiracy theories about whatever, different people controlling how the humans are doing things. But those are other humans and those humans are just like in this collective like consciousness and the people who are doing it, which is everyone, are all subconsciously involved in the whole situation. So it's not that like there's like a secret Freemason meeting happening where they're like, okay, step one, we're gonna do this. It's like, no, 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 we're all moving towards this thing together. It's a little bit messed up at times, but basically conspiracy, conspiracies are actually real. We're all doing it, but we're just not like actually conspiring in a weird like cinematic table meeting type way. We're all just like moving towards some real messed up things at times as a species. Um, so I think there's just like a collective consciousness, a subconscious consciousness of all the humans doing random things. Seemingly random, but not random. Um, and then another thing that I like to talk about a lot, this is where I began with the whole ant theory, was how people build tunnels and roads, just the way ants do. Like ant cities, when you go to like an ant hill, there's all these different like chambers and like uh, tunnels between the chambers and like they build their little infrastructure just the way we do with our cities it's crazy um, and then they go out into the world and they have their little like roads that they drive down <laughs> they're walking but they're like you know what I'm saying so it's like roads and then even in like Canada in the northern cities like Edmonton Calgary Winnipeg they all have actual tunnels that the people are using to get from one place to another because it's too cold um, to be outside in the elements so it's like yeah we are literally building like these like below ground above ground ant hills that are made of concrete um, but yeah basically we all just sort of like assemble for like collective survival and purpose and I just think it's very similar to how ants are so deep thoughts you're welcome I just thought I'd um point that very important very important very important uh similarity between the species so I don't know ants I feel like that's why there's so many good are there like two or three different ant movies now and they're all like um, relating to how people are, whatever. Anyways, look, I'm at the beach, but I'm in the car because it's really windy. So I made this video. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much the end of the rant. There's more like branches of why we're like ants, but I just thought I'd do the main two, like tunnels and roads, conspiracy theories. It's all subconscious. Anyway, um, hope you're doing well. <laughs> I'll see you on the next one. Peace!